Hey, what's up guys? So in this video, we will see how to set up IR Blaster on any Xiaomi Redmi smartphone. Now, first of all, make sure that your smartphone supports IR Blaster. Now, to check if your smartphone supports IR Blaster or not, just look at the top of your smartphone. Now, if you see this sensor, this means that your smartphone supports IR Blaster. If you don't have the sensor, this means that your smartphone does not support the IR Blaster feature and you cannot enable it. Now, if your smartphone supports IR Blaster, just go to the Play Store and search Mi Remote. Now from here, just install this application. Now, as you can see, I have already installed Mi Remote on my smartphone. If it is not installed on your smartphone yet, just tap on install. And once the app is fully downloaded, tap on open. Now you can add a new remote if you tap on the plus icon at the upper right corner on the display. Or you can add a new remote by tapping on add remote if you're using the app for the first time. Now, just tap on add remote. Now from here, as you can see, you can create a remote for your TV, your fan, your receiver, and some other home appliances. Now for today's video, we will create a remote for our TV. Now from here, just search the name of your TV. For an example, we will search LG. Now from here, just tap on the name of your TV. From here, as you can see, it is asking if your TV is currently on or off. Now tap on on if your TV is on and tap on off if your TV is currently off. Now, as you can see, there are seven configurations available and it will check which one will work on your device. Now from here, just point your smartphone at your TV and tap on this button. Now from here, it is asking, does your TV turn on or off? Now, if you tap on this button and your TV responds by turning on or off, tap on yes. And if you tap on this button and your TV does not respond, tap on no. Now, as you can see, as I tap no, it went to the next configuration and it will keep doing that until your TV turns on. Now, for an example, if I point my smartphone to the TV and I tap on this button, and my TV responds by turning on or off, just tap yes. Now, as you can see, this is the name of our device, LG TV. Now, for an example, if you have an LG TV in your office and one in your bedroom and one in your living room, you can customize the name of your remote by tapping on one of these boxes. Now, for an example, if you're creating your remote for the LG TV in your office, just tap on office and it will rename the name of your remote to Office LG TV. Now from here, make sure you enable this option if you want to add shortcut. Now from here, tap on Done and tap on Paired. Now, as you can see, this is the remote we just created. Now, if you tap on the back button, you can see the remote we just created. And if you want to access the remote, just tap on it and it you can access your remote. If you found this video helpful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to get notified when we upload a new video.